The Fed came out today, decreased the Fed funds rate by approximately a half of a percentage point. So you might be asking, what exactly does this mean for me as an American prospective homeowner, right? Prospective home buyer, excuse me. So in today's video, that's exactly what I'm going to unpack with all of you. My name is Jimmy Versalino, mortgage loan originator. So let's dive right in. So when the Fed decreases the Fed funds rate, right? That's the rate at which banks lend money to each other overnight. Essentially what they're doing is, is they're lowering the cost of borrowing on things like auto loans, credit cards, adjustable rate mortgages, and home equity lines of credit. What that does not mean is that the rate on a 30-year fixed rate mortgage just went down by a half of a percentage point today. In fact, uh, it might surprise you that mortgage interest rates actually finished the day slightly higher on this news. However, comma, right? If you zoom out and you look at what's taking place in the economy, right? Inflation has subsided. In fact, mortgage interest rates have gone down to their lowest levels since February of 2023. So when inflation subsides, right? And the Fed is trying to stimulate the economy, right? We expect that mortgage interest rates will continue to go lower in the weeks and months to come. In fact, it was stated today that there could be additional rate cuts on the table for 2024 and into 2025. So you purchased a home in the last 18 months, it may not be a bad idea to do a refinance analysis to see if a potential refi could be in your best interest, allowing you to save money in the form of payment and interest. If you are a prospective home buyer, now may be a good time with mortgage interest rates going to their lowest levels since February of 2023. See how much you feel comfortable spending. Get with a real estate professional who can show you what that monthly mortgage payment would translate to in the form of a purchase price in your market, right? Because as inflation continues to go lower, so too will interest rates, meaning more buyers will A, come back into the market and B, this could create additional demand and more competition, I might add, which could only potentially increase values or as a result. So we'll continue to monitor the market. If you have questions about this stuff, know that I'm always here to be a resource. I hope you found that this information was of value and we'll talk to you soon.